What's up, fight fans? This is Kurt DeVille with Counterpunch Boxing News, and I have some new news concerning Alexander Usyk, Tyson the Gypsy King Fury. Get this, according to Team Usyk, that they're still waiting on the contract from Tyson Fury, and he hasn't, or they haven't seemed to want this fight due to that fact. They have, or seem to have no desire to sign the contract. Obviously, Tyson Fury has lost his pen. Let me counterpunch. Uh, I don't think that that will satisfy and make Bob Arum very happy hearing that. <laughs> because we know Bob Arum was, you know, they should shut up and allow this to happen in private. Well, obviously, that's not working. The privacy is not working because they are still waiting for the contract they have not even sent them a contract to say yay or nay. And it makes me wonder what the hell was Alex Krusik really doing there if he's not still there in the UK to finalize this fight. What we did hear after he got there is um, he needs to be a Hollywood actor asking for that type of money because they were reflecting for the denial of Tyson Fury after he turned down the offer from Khalid or Khalid turned down his counter offer from him. Okay. So that's when Bob Arum spoke about being private and not allowing this to go to the public's eye and making the deal over the uh, internet or um, through social media. However, that's the only way we're really going to know because when people let, let things uh, no, be known of what's going on from day to day, the steps that they're taking, the steps that they're making, what they've done to add to the situation, to help the situation, then we can have a clear idea to what's really going on, okay? And them telling us that is just them letting you know that, hey, these guys are not really seeming, seeming to want this fight. Now, I do wonder why Tyson Fury, since the ball is in their court, what they're going to offer. What slice of the pie will they offer for this particular fight? And... Alex Krusik is really just giving out public receipts showing, hey, we're waiting for them, not the other way around. So I think at the very end of the day with uh, Tyson Fury and Alexander Usyk, if they just go ghost and silent, they don't want this fight. We just heard Mike Tyson talk about, hey, it's a good idea. He has a puncher's chance. So they may be trying to promote Francis Ngono behind the scenes. If anything, counterpunching Bob Arum. If you don't want things to go public, stop talking about other fights publicly. If you don't want other fights publicly to be to get made and you're only really truly focusing on the Alexander Usyk versus Tyson Fury undisputed undefeated fight, then stop talking about the idea of Francis Ngono and all this other rubbish. But anyway, you guys tell me what you think of Team Usyk saying that Tyson Fury has seemingly lost his pen. Of course, please subscribe, and you guys been counterpunch. Peace!